When explaining how to adjust the blade of a Kana hand plane, we will refer to the parts as follows. For the plane body, we'll say head and tail. For the plane blades, we'll say blade and chip breaker. To adjust the blade, tap the top of the blade with a hammer to move the blade forward. While you are doing this, be sure to look at the sole of the plane body to observe the blade as it approaches the mouth of the sole. The blade should only protrude about a hair width beyond the mouth of the sole. This is all that is needed to make clean shavings. If the blade protrudes too much, tap the head of the plane body to move the blade backwards. Be sure to alternate the taps on either side of the head. You do not need to tap harder than what is shown in this tutorial. It is important to never tap the center of the plane body's head with the hammer. Doing so can cause the plane body to split or crack. If the edge of the blade is protruding at an angle from the mouth of the sole, you can adjust the blade by tapping on the shoulder of the side that is sticking out beyond the mouth. Make sure that the edge of the blade is horizontal with the sole of the plane body before using your Kana hand plane. To adjust the chip breaker, tap the top of it to bring its edge close to the blade's edge. Continue tapping the chip breaker until the edge is just a hair width apart from the blade's edge. If the edges are too close, the hand plane will not shave. When this happens, you will need to move the blade and chip breaker backward and start again. To remove the blades, hold the plane body with one hand while using your finger to secure the blade and chip breaker. Tap the head of the plane body to move the blades backwards. You do not need to tap harder than what is shown in this tutorial. Once loose, pull the blade and chip breaker out carefully to avoid dropping them.